I guess my hockey career has uh, taken sort of a drastic change recently, actually. Uh, I was down in the States playing junior hockey and unfortunately, you know, took my fifth and sixth head injury and uh, the doctor sort of, you know, came to that conclusion that it might be time to hang up the skates. So, you know, you got to protect your health at the end of the day. You know, there's more to life than just hockey. So that's sort of where I had to make that switch. And I decided to, you know, put myself, put all my energy and try to fill that void I had with hockey and missing the sport and missing my teammates and just missing the lifestyle of being on the road, playing junior hockey. Like, that's something I always wanted to do, you know, being a kid from Muskoka. So uh, just sort of being pulled out of that and told you can't go back was just sort of a, a big shocker and a big eye opener for me. So. When the uh, pandemic originally happened, and that all sort of happened at the same time for me, so it really plunged me back into the social media account I created when I was younger. So that's always hockey, so that's what we do now. We do the craziest trick shots and videos and skills you could imagine, so that's, the, that's what we've been doing and I've been loving it. The love we've received online has been uh, pretty amazing, actually. I, I never thought that, you know, videos like this, just me out in my backyard here filming, would, you know, get this many views and this much attention online. And I've just seen it really, really grab the younger audience and that next generation of hockey players. And I'm just trying to show them, you know, there's, there's more ways to be involved in the sport. You don't have to be a pro hockey player. You don't have to go to the NHL. You can always be involved with what you love, and you can always get into a position in the sport and love what you do. So... Uh, I think we're just trying to really show kids that the world is changing, social media is changing, the, the standard business structure is changing, so we're just trying to be that, you know, a good role model and influence for the younger generation of hockey players, and at the end of the day, we're just trying to get everybody around the world, any kid, to just pick up that hockey stick and give it a try, right? So, that's the goal. Uh, a lot of hours alone in the, uh, the driveway and stuff, just working on new moves and just creating different things that nobody had seen before. So that was sort of uh, my vision and my goal. I just wanted to be different. I wanted to show people a different side to the sport, a different side of the game, and just have fun with it every day of your life, right? So it's been, uh, it's been absolutely amazing for me and the experiences we've had from this, you know, going to the All-Star Games and the events and being part of all the NHL media stuff. And like it goes beyond too, beyond hockey, we got a lot of fans and people from, you know, places in the world that don't have ice or have never seen the sport so it's just a new a new lane and a new way to just sort of get hockey in front of more people worldwide so that that's our goal and our main goal will always be to grow the game catch more on always hockey guys <laughs>